Hi guys. Um, I have got to apologize to all of you because I have not uploaded a video in so long because the last time that I tried to upload my computer was acting crazy and it was an epic fail and it didn't even upload. So I'm going to attempt to do this one. I have tons of other videos like that I have to upload. I have been so busy. Um, I won't even run you through all of that, but just a hair update that I wanted to do really quickly. Um, I'm still transitioning. I'm having a wonderful time. This journey is fun. Learning about my hair, learning about hair in general. Um, I have a lot of growth. I am trimming from my ends and um, I can see my length as my hair is growing from the root. Um, it's actually way longer than it was when I first started transitioning. Um, it's really soft. It's thick. I don't have a lot of breakage at all because of how I'm taking care of it, uh, the perm part. I actually have a very extensive regimen. I make all of my own stuff and I also sell all of my own stuff because it's worked so well for me. I am learning a lot about hair as I do research. Um, there's a chemistry to this and it's so cool. Um, I am now still using my hair deep conditioning spray. It's a daily spray. I'm still using that every day. I have incorporated pure aloe vera water. And the cool thing about aloe vera is it is the same pH as your hair. So if you're using anything or your hair is stripped of what it needs and to balance it pH wise, then you can shock it with some aloe water or you can just get a plant rub it on your scalp i actually don't put the aloe from root to tip most of the stuff that i use i put it on my root and on my tips i do oil them because they're the most fragile but when it comes to the um the water um i find that my hair when the perm parts are too wet they break easily so i try to keep them moisturized with the oil and and i Pretty much take care of my roots a little different my new growth a little different than my ends but i am taking care of them both equally i'm also doing a deep conditioner every week and i made my own i love it it does have pure aloe in it i do sell that um but right now i'm actually using the stash that i would sell because i like it that much I am using essential oils. I made my own lavender infused essential oil. You can make your own. Um, that Because uh, lavender is good for all hair types, especially if your hair is itchy. So I'm, I'm really staying with the whole natural uh, regimen um, because it's working for me. It just really is. I've had tremendous results from it. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to swivel around. And let you guys kind of see what's going on with my hair. This is what my hair was like as a child, but it was much longer. It was really thick, but minus the perm on the ends. Like, this is really what it looked like. I remember when before my mom straightened it, you know. I have been wearing it, like, plaited up. Um, this is a result of, like, a bunch of plaits. I can't really rock a ponytail while like talking about it because my head gets sore in the middle, but I did have one today. Sometimes I'll do it just to be lazy. Very seldomly, though. So tonight, I'm going to actually plait it up and let my scalp breathe. Um, what else? Uh, that's pretty much, in a nutshell, what I've been doing. I'm going to swivel around. I'm not going to make, make this video long, and I'll try to get the old ones up so you can kind of track my journey as I've been documenting it, and I've I'm going to try to do this. I've been so busy. I make soap and natural products, so I've been busy with that and selling it. And I do photography, and I've been busy with that. And I do homeschooling, and I've been busy with that. And I'm a wife, and I've been busy with that. <sighs> yeah. So, you get the picture. Let me swivel for you. Okay, so this is what's going on with my hair. And I will clip my ends like, oh, that's what I forgot to tell you guys. Um, I am going to clip my ends like every two to three months as my hair grows, I'm going to clip every two to three months. Okay. That's pretty much what I'm doing. 
and it's working for me look y'all i cut this this is actually natural that's one of my natural curls and i cut these at some natural curls i'm excited about those oh i'm still using the flaxseed gel too okay still using the flax so anyway that is my update on my hair and I am so sorry I've been away so long. I'm going to try to get those old, video, old videos up. And for all of you who have subscribed to my videos, thank you. I'm a newbie to this, so hopefully I'll get some more subscriptions and stuff um, and be more consistent with uploading videos. But anyway, smooches, love you. Thanks for watching. Bye.